if you set a big goal for yourself and then you look at it after a month and you go, oh my goodness, I'm so far away from that. I'm never going to. But if you have set, if you have that big goal, but you have set incremental goals, at least then you can measure progress towards it. That's right. That's absolutely correct. So uh, for instance, if I'm saying, okay, I want to lose my weight by 10 kgs in the next six months, right? So just saying that won't reduce my weight at all, right? Mm -hmm. I need to see how I go, how, how frequently I'm going to measure that and what steps I'm going to take to achieve that. For instance, I can maybe uh, have a smartwatch or maybe uh, put an app on my, like the Google Fit app is very good app on my mobile device and start tracking my steps. And my daily activity, the trackable item would be, I will be uh, having 10,000 steps in a day, right? So if you are doing that constantly on daily basis, no one is uh, going to uh, stop you from achieving your goal. You will be very easily able to achieve your goal, right? So whatever your goal is, you need to divide that into fragments. You need to see what exactly you are going to do to achieve that and then start doing that. Basically, what I have seen is a lot of people say like they feel when whenever they talk about goal they they feel like oh i wish i could do that or maybe if i'll do half of that i'll be very happy but you should see your goals in terms of commitment that mm -hmm. okay this is my goal and i am committed to this i am going to achieve this right if you if you start thinking in that way and you start feeling committed in that terms even for the first month you are lagging a bit but since you are committed towards it you are going to achieve it.